This video will follow several demonstrations that fit under the category of rotational banding. These demos suggest the banded appearance of Jovian planets. Let's motivate these demonstrations by exploring the characteristics of Jovian planets. Which of the following characteristics of Jovian planets is most responsible for their banded appearance? Classroom students should follow normal procedures or instructor guidelines. Viewers not in a classroom should record your vote and explain your reasoning on a piece of paper. Please pause this video and answer the question. Note that all of the characteristics mentioned are true for all of the Jovian planets. They are all massive, large, low density, far from the sun, and rapid rotators. A day on Jupiter lasts about 10 hours, and a day is less than 18 hours for all of the Jovian planets. It is the rapid rotation of the gaseous giants that gives rise to the banded appearance, most noticeable for Jupiter, but present for Saturn and Neptune as well. This demonstration will make use of rheoscopic fluid, a useful tool for visualizing flow patterns in a liquid. Rheoscopic literally means current showing. It contains non-soluble platelets of the mineral mica, metallic flakes, or even fish scales suspended in a fluid. The platelets align themselves with the direction of fluid motion and allow you to see it. Once the motion ceases, the platelets move randomly, diffusing light in all directions. We have placed a large amount of rheoscopic fluid in a large Florence flask and place it on a rotating platform. Note that one can observe small amounts of turbulent motions from our movement of the flask. We spin the platform and watch the motion generate the rotational banding that is common in Jovian planets. Note that there are many other directions that this demonstration could take. We could add food coloring, different lighting sources, containers of different shape, or place it on a heating source to observe convection currents. Here is a small flask of dyed rheoscopic fluid that resembles the planet Neptune when rotated. There are a number of no-frills similar devices. One involves mica, a mineral with shiny flakes ground into powdered form that can be easily purchased on the web. If one takes a plastic container, fills it with water, and dissolves in a little mica powder, voila, we have a rheoscopic fluid. It is also possible to purchase a sphere filled with rheoscopic fluid very suggestive of a Jovian planet. These are also easily purchased on the web, but in our experience, they don't last very long. Planets rotate due to the conservation of angular momentum of the collapsing spinning material from which they are formed. But bands are more complicated. Jupiter consists almost entirely of gas, which results in differential rotation. A rotation of material near Jupiter's poles takes slightly longer than the rotation near its equator. This effect leads to the oblate bulging of the planet. Because the planet is entirely fluid and gas, heat from the interior of the planet causes convective currents within the rotation. The interaction of the convective cells and the rapidly rotating gases cause the banded pattern seen in the atmosphere of the planet. The lighter colored zones are caused by warmer rising gases, while the darker belts are caused by cooler falling gases. The belts and zones have different depths and thus appear to rotate in opposite directions due to having different speeds. Because of this, we see turbulence and vortices along the boundaries between them. More teaching materials can be found on the web at astro.unl.edu.